Hey guys, Dylan Chalk here, Orca Inspection Services and Scribeware, and just want to dive into unlimited modifiers and give you a few points of why I think these are so important for home inspectors. Uh, so this is a report I did the other day. It's a mid-century modern place. These are the modifiers I used. So major concern, repair, recommended maintenance. So in Scribeware, you can have unlimited modifiers. You can give them different colors. You can give them different names. You can give them different definitions. And we will only print in the report the ones that you have used in that report. So you could have some for homeowners association items or incomplete items and things that aren't even in this particular job. To me, it's nearly impossible to do a thorough home inspection and not be able to break up the information for the client. So as I mentioned in that lead up with uh, AFCIs, you know, to me, that's an easy improvement item, all the modern code changes and stuff. So notice I have 12 improvement items in this old mid-century modern house, and one of them is AFCI protection and a heat detector in the garage, and there's older hose bibs. Um, we'll jump into one here. Older stairs noted, you know, and, um, you know, uh, the guardrails incomplete. There's inadequate head height. Uh, so I've got a nice clear little list of the things that wouldn't meet today's code, but I list it as an improvement or an upgrade because that's how they built it. So it allows for super clear communication. Uh, I, I, I want to dive into a new construction inspection because one of my favorite modifiers on a new build is incomplete items. And I, there's actually a huge difference if you're doing a new build between a repair item and an incomplete item. Uh, so many years ago, probably 15 years ago, I was doing uh, a, a new construction inspection and it was a builder that I, I respected and I wanted him to respect my services. And I did the inspection. I had 30 repair items or whatever. And I, I came back two weeks later and he looked at me and he said, those weren't repair items. I wasn't done with them yet. And he was kind of pissed. And I started to think about it. And a part of me was like, well, you know, <laughs> too bad. But the other part of me was like, you know, you're spot on. So let's say you hire me to do your inspection on a new build and I find 30 repairs. That tells us the builder didn't know what they were doing. They were making mistakes. They were getting things wrong, installing things incorrectly. Makes me worried about all kinds of stuff that I don't know on that build. Uh, if I have 30 incomplete items, it tells me I showed up two weeks too early. That is a world of difference and a really powerful example of Inscribeware is, is not a report writing app. It's a communications tool that lets you communicate clearly and efficiently with your clients. And it lets you build a reputation as a great home inspector and build your business off of great reports. So uh, anyway, that's these incomplete modifiers. So I hope this helps. But uh, really, when you're considering report writing software and how you want to grow your home inspection business, think seriously about the power of unlimited modifiers. Thanks for watching.